Denzel, your thumpers are clean. Look at that. So Denzel and Sally have been using their new litter box for about a week now, and we're gonna go through some pros and cons of the new box. So first of all, he has clean feet, which is a really good sign. That's why I got this litter box in the first place. Something else I really like is that it's definitely big enough for both Denzel and Sally, and Denzel's kind of a big bunny. Since there's this separation where the poop and the pee and everything drops down below, when they pull the hay out of their hay rack, the hay's been getting stuck on top too, which kind of defeats the purpose of having the separation because then they just do all their business on top of the hay. I have been constantly having to go and grab the hay off the top and get it out of the way so that when they do use the bathroom, it does drop down. It's not a big deal, but it is something that I've been having to keep up with. Another thing is that when I clean it, you just lift the top right off. I have to be really careful with where I set it down because sometimes pee collects on the bottom of it. Once I realized this, I started setting it on its side like this when I go to clean it. But then the other day, so much pee had collected on the bottom of it that it started dripping down it. Every day when I go to clean the litter box, I have to wipe the top and the bottom of this down to get rid of all of the dried pee. I think I've sneezed about 30 times in making this video because my allergies are just killing me today and this hay's not helping. But another thing with this box is that I thought it would be nice to try to use puppy pads um, on the bottom of it to help cut down on using so much litter because at least with this way, they have no way of accessing the puppy pad and I've always just been worried about them chewing on it accidentally since it's nearby where their hay is. So this way they can't reach the puppy pad, which is nice, but the puppy pads have not been doing a very good job of getting all the stuff and I've been double lining it plus putting regular paper pellets on the bottom too. I would show you what it looks like, but the video will probably be censored if I do but when I pick all of this up, I'll just have to wipe out the bottom because it'll be collected under there. Overall, I think it is a nice litter box, but my main concern is just keeping that hay from being built up on top. I'll have to see if I can find some sort of solution for the hay building up, but ultimately it does serve its purpose as a litter box and Denzel and Sully have no problem with it. Now I just need to clean it and hopefully I don't sneeze a hundred more times.